I've been living in Big Sur for 25 years. When I first came to Big Sur, I had, a, I had a, an incredible sense of I'm at home. When I'm gathering my wood, I always give thanks for the trees. They're such a beautiful form. So I always feel like I'm kind of honoring the tree by making something beautiful. I've been making these nests since I was about 12, 13 years old, and I started making them for fun, and then they grew into an art form that I've developed over time. When I started building the nests as a kid, the inspiration was for me connecting with nature. A lot of it is dedicated to the spirits of the land. Most of the trees I work with grow along the ocean, so there's a lot of wind and it makes the tree branches really spiral. In all my nests you see these big spirals and that's inspired by the wind patterns and how they shape the branches along the coast. Actually, I think I would like to build a nest down there, but I'd have to make a trail first. <laughs> California is a place that's really open. There's so many possibilities. And as an artist, there's so much inspiration in the nature, but also from other artists. And look at that, they almost have, each one has its place it wants to go. So you just have to find where, where the branch wants to go. It's like a puzzle. I love art that combines something that you can interact with, that's utilitarian and, and is also a creative expression. Most artists just, they need to create. It's not something that you find courage to do. You just, you have to do it. You know, it's, it's who you are. Find that thing inside of you that, that brings you to life and that makes you happy and, and, and go for it.